Shirada. We are reading from Shishi Vilapa Kusumanjali, verse 40. O Devi, Goddess, when will I decorate your teeth with reddish lines, making them look just like pearls with lines of ruby on them. O Devi, Goddess, when will I decorate your teeth with reddish lines, making them look just like pearls with lines of ruby on them. The stream of Shiragunata's transcendental visions flows on. This time, he serves Swamini's row of teeth, saying, O oh Goddess, when will I decorate your teeth with reddish lines, making them look just like pearls with lines of ruby on them. Shiragunata's heart is filled with an amazing eagerness to serve his Swaminiji. Just as food does not taste sweet when one is not hungry, the flavor of devotional service is not astonishing when there is no eagerness in the that, devoted heart. That's the point. If the eagerness is there, it becomes good. Swami stood behind Raguna to relish the sweetness of his eager and earnest devotion. That's the point. What Swami is watching, how much which mandiri is how much eager. And how much she is ready for self. Underline this line. How she has the time? Once she is near, she watch. Then she is far, she is still coming. But like a mama, she cares the baby. Our mother 
also what are the issues of playing with me. And when the child is eager, like if Radhika, she's not eager at this moment, but Mohan is more eager at this moment. Then Mama has to be more than Radhika. It depends upon the eagerness <coughs> and the devotion of Mm-hmm. And so ready to be with Mother Vaishnava. He always watching for the season. When we become grown up, our season must become less. Because it's our faults and identification. My ego cover. Ego cover. So my ego is covered by God. So. <coughs> It's all depends upon my eagerness. That is eagerness, <laughs> greed, Dhruva is mercy, what you give the next. Dhruva is mercy also one pointed. <laughs> what are the forces that uh, block? Blocking of my material identification by control by my falsehood to identify my soul consciousness and the soul identity. They block and bring that to my body. So the eagerness is always the same, but it's blocked sometimes. I block, blocking to my eagerness. That's what's not changing. Right. When I come to my material identification, as per the material circumstances, we bifurcate our eagerness. We distribute to many places. <coughs> This has to do, this has to do, this has to do. So the, right goal is to... The goal is to liberate the eagerness, to open it up. Yes, right. One point. One. Many pointed, no either. We cannot say it's eagerness. There are many things to solve. One of that is also this. Eagerness means one point in madness. I have to do it. It's like one boss or two boss. The problem we have two bosses, yeah. it comes to an Boss is always one. There is never two bosses. Boss becomes two, that is our problem. My ego becomes boss. Then we can give the right place to my son. So we travel in between two bosses. Yes. My false ego is my boss, or my soul is my boss. Then, then so many I didn't even see not appears because you don't even fix yourself. 
दो की आ जाओ हम लोग तैयार हैं भागवत के बात करो The flavor of devotional service is not astonishing when there is no eagerness. Yeah, no, no astonishing. Like you are no hungry, your belly is full with other stuff. You eating too too many things of material circumstances. And you have no eagerness for spirituality, for your Asamni service. So eagerness is not there to to be there. What? I have no time, we said. <laughs> no time for <laughs> how eagerness comes <laughs> when there is no time. Mm. <laughs> Swamini stood behind Raghunath to relish the sweetness of his eager and earnest devotion. She, she did not show herself in front of him. The Lord enjoys the eagerness of his devotees. Bhaktera prema vikara dekhi Krishnera chamatkara Krishna yara napaya anta keva chara ara Krishna is astonished when he sees the devotees loving transformations. Even Krishna cannot find the limit to their loving ecstasy. What to speak of ordinary living beings? That was Chaitanya Charitam. Therefore, Swamini increases the ocean of Raghunatha's prema by making him more eager. Sri yeah. Raghunatha's heart is very eager to attain the personal service of Sri Radha's lotus feet. By crying in a heart rending way for Swamini. He caused Sri Rupa Goswami's heart to melt. <laughs> Therefore, Sri Rupa Goswami ended his Dana Keli Kaumudi with the following prayer for Raghunatha's sake. 
he wrote. Oh, Madhava, my friend, Raghunath Das, has given up all other activities and is now living in a cottage on the bank of Radha Kumna, very anxious to exclusively serve you and Sri Radhika. You always cast your merciful glance on those who live in Vrindavana and you fulfill all their desires. So please make the tree of his Raghunathas aspirations bear fruit soon. In this Vilapa Kusumanjali, Shiragunath Dasa Goswami offers flower-like lamentations at Srimati's lotus feet and renders loving devotional service to her. With love steeped minds and eyes, the Raganuga devotees should see and relish the picture drawn with bhava. A picture of the intense suffering the maid servant goes through day and night when she is separated from her beloved mistress. How much relish and how many hundreds of different moods are revealed in these lamentations of separation. This can be learned from Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's lamentations in the Gambira pastimes. Yeah. While Mahaprabhu lamented in this way, agitation and ecstasy awoke in his heart. And he could not find any support or hold in his mind. Different ecstasies like Eagerness, lamentation, fear, attention, complacency, and remembrance met in his heart. Underline what eagerness? Different ecstasies like eagerness, lamentation, fear, attention, complacency, and remembrance met in his heart. Yeah. <clears throat> All at the same time, one by one coming up. Yes, why fear? If you are eager for someone and he is 10 minutes late, you become 
Yeah. Attention. Always you are attentive. Any car on or noise comes there. Lover is come. Attention. Always care. Always attentive for one point. Nothing. Complacent. Huh? This means feeling of satisfaction with one's self or with one's achievements. Is that? <laughs> Never. Never. Yeah, I also Never. don't know. Never satisfaction. <laughs> Every moment, I no missing. I am eagerness means. I meet, but again I become eager. So satisfaction is not there. <laughs> Eagerness make you eager means no satisfaction. Yeah. All and time, remember. Eh? <laughs> but ten minutes you go out, my eagerness grows. Again, I know, 15 minutes you are coming back. But why just eager message? My daughter Chandra say, why you become eager to me? I said, what to say? I'm relishing. Eagerness out there to this. Eagerness make you all just that is always some eager, and the mind is also eager. Similar. Yes. No. Eagerness nature issues. Anyone will become eager, he will have to go in this circumstance. And he's also. But this is greedy eagerness. If I am full with my baby, you give me best food to eat, I am full. Eagerness is not there for you. And this is the material world. Baby is full with satisfied and I am not eager for these things. To go for my spiritual Sarup identity and I develop this. This is a problem. It was in the ecstasy of Sri Radha that all these Sanchari Bhavas arose in the heart of the Lord. Who is known as Bhava Nidhi, the ocean of transcendental ecstasy. This is also called Bhava Shabalya, 
or a clashing of different contradicting emotions. Just as a vision of Krishna appeared in his mind, the strong eagerness to attain him conquered all the other feelings and took place like a king on the throne of the Lord's heart. His highly developed eagerness conquered all other soldiers of ecstasy and an uncontrollable desire arose in the kingdom of his mind. Then he sadly rebuked his own mind. Sorry. Then he sadly rebuked his own mind. Without Krishna, my poor mind will die within a moment, just like a fish out of water. His sweetly smiling face which is like a reviving elixir for the mind and eyes, doubles my thirst for Krishna. Oh, treasure of my heart, oh, lotus-eyed one, O ocean of divine qualities, O Mohana, O wearer of the yellow dhoti, O hero of the Rasa Lila, where should I go to find you? Tell me, and I will go there. Saying this, Mahaprabhu began to run. Swarup got up and, though, and brought the Lord back on his lap. Then Swarupa brought the Lord back to his own place and seated him there. Because Srila Raghunathas Goswami is a receptacle of Mahaprabhu's full grace, different waves of bhava headed by eagerness, are seen to arise in him also. In a transcendental vision, Sri Dasa says, Devi, Tulasi sees how much Srimati's sweetness increases 
because she awoke the remembrance of the lila rasa in her heart while putting the mask drop on her chin and so she calls her devi devi means effulgent and most beautiful girl tulasi will now draw red lines on swami mistik shiradika sits on a golden seat and extends her matchless bodily luster tulasi holds her left hand on shrimati's head and slightly lifts her moonlike face holding a brush in her right hand tulasi makes red lines on shrimati white feet with deep concentration saying your teeth are just like pomegranate seed that will attract the parrot from rindavan their bright effulgence will destroy the darkness of his lonely despair seeing the red lines on shrimati's teeth tulasi is astonished and says aha how beautiful your teeth are they look just like pearls with lines of ruby on them <coughs> they will act just to increase the greed of the parrot from rindavan if he can enjoy this then all my endeavors are successful When Swamini hears Tulasi's words she imagines that Mohana is sitting at her feet praying to her in great humility and with tear-filled eyes If you say even the slightest thing the moonlight of your beautiful teeth will take away the dense darkness the nectar of your lips that emanates 
from your moonlike space pleases my chakora bird like eyes. So I have a question. Can I ask this this red line brother on the teeth of Rasamayi, uh, would you continue to read and we will see what will happen when Guru Dev come back in connections, please. Okay. The nectar of your lips that emanates from your moon-like face pleases my chakora bird-like eyes. O oh, beloved, O oh, girl with the beautiful nature, Give up your causeless speak. My mind burns in the fire of lust. Please give me the honey drink from your lotus-like face. Tulasi's prattling crystallizes Mohana before Swami. How many pastimes can she awaken 
within Swamini's memory. Now it is as if Swamini is Krishna Krida Pujara Vasati Nagari, the empress of the town of Krishna's play and worship. That is why Tulasi calls her Devi. Tulasi draws red lines on Swamini's feet. and is astonished by their beauty, saying, Aha, how beautiful are your teeth. They look just like pearls with lines of ruby on them. All these endeavors are made to increase the greed of the Krishna parent. When he can relish this, all my endeavors have become worthwhile. The beauty of this peerless service must be learned from the Goswamis. It is the service of Mahabhava and must be understood through Mahabal. Jai Ho! Yes. Jasa Mai, could you start from the beginning? It was so beautiful when you, the first sentence about the lip. Mm. Yes, my dear. If you say even the slightest thing, The moonlight of your beautiful teeth will take away the dense darkness. The nectar of your lips that emanates from your moonlike face pleases my chakora bird-like eyes. Yeah. Oh, beloved. Oh, girl with the beautiful nature. Give up your causeless peak. My mind 
burns in the fire of lust. Please give me the honey drink from your lotus like face. Dulasi's prattling crystallizes Mohana in front of Swami. How many pastimes can she awaken within Swamini's memory? Now it is as if Swamini is Krishna Krita Pujara Vasati Nagari, the empress of the town of Krishna's play and worship. That is why Tulasi calls her Devi. Tulasi draws red lines on Swamini's teeth and is astonished by their beauty, saying, Aha! How beautiful are your teeth! They look just like pearls with lines of ruby on them. All these endeavors are made to increase the greed of the Krishna parrot. When he can relish this, all my endeavors have become worthwhile. The beauty of this fearless service must be learned from the Goswamis. It is the service of Mahabhava and must be understood through Mahabhava. Where are the insignificant living entities and where is that Mahabhava? the essence of love of God. But now, in this particular age of Kali, the afflicted souls have become so fortunate to enter into this kingdom of Mahabhav which is otherwise difficult to access by the special mercy of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Being empowered by Mahaprabhu, the Goswamis have revealed this kingdom. And the only way to get the great fortune of relishing Swamini's devotional service is to follow in their footsteps. Rasa 
can only be understood through personal experience. And it can only be attained by the mercy of the Rasika devotees. Shirad. Little loud because there are many disturbances. Yeah, you have to speak louder. जितना जो सीढ़ी टूटा हुआ है उसको रिपेयर करा लो उसमें रखवाओगे बाहर सब को रखवा दो कोई चीज को रिपेयर कराना वो आए उसको से करवा दो नाउ इन दिस पर्टिकुलर एज ऑफ काली the afflicted souls have become kal aaya sabere sab tak baat lo mane wale hain kal to bas aaya ya the afflicted souls yes. have become so fortunate to enter into this kingdom of mahabhav which is otherwise difficult to access by the special mercy of shri chaitanya mahaprabhu being empowered by mahaprabhu the goswamis have revealed this kingdom and the only way to get the great fortune of relishing swamini's devotional service is to follow in their footsteps rasa can only be understood through personal experience and it can only be attained by the mercy of the rasika devotees radhe <laughs> the desired leela katha cannot be done with others than with rasika devotees uh, again the desired leela katha talks about radha mohanas pastimes cannot be done with others than with rasika devotees yes. they will be not interested how many are there they are not interested many devotees are there ek ek but they are all not interested to listen the past and they are interested to gather the information and some sloka for la puja prasasta past time who has a sukriti narad mara se previous sanskar who is not without a previous sanskar i can desire that comes for this thing the past and when the previous sanskar is there then some rasik association will happen in 
our life, like I will meet with Rasika Vaishnava. And we can share it. Without Rasik, you cannot share. You cannot sit and share this. They are not interested. Yes, very nice. Because Rasika but devotees, they have experience. Some mercy. Previous Sukruti, some mercy they have. That previous <coughs> Sukruti is not age factor. Maybe 60 years, no previous Sukruti, and 30 years, lady and male has a previous Sukruti. Because it's not means with the age, it's the meaning of the your previous mercy is there, one day it happens. It comes and you become interested. This You can desire to become more interested in it. Desire? But previous Sukriti takes time. Desire comes from Sukriti. No Sukriti knows desire. Desire or not. Desire will come, then some uh, material influence will attack you and then not. Mercy is important. Like you imagine, you I got all of you that they are ready to take all the burden. Gopina took the burden of all the seva and this of Everyone is you know, doing what they can do and I'm free. Yeah? Sons took the burden of material thing. They say, no, I don't need you. So every place is free, no? In the previous security, how it's possible to they make you free? You took our burden. <laughs> is it possible to get the help us to get some security? Yes. In our area, wherever we are, how is it possible? It's mercy. Mercy when it's happening. And Radharani wants to use you to help others, they will do it. And you have to do it. Prasadam? And many things. We are instruments, we cannot decide and it happens. You see, here I show you here. I cannot take care of one cow, 25,000. It's my effort, no effort. I cannot feed 10 people every day, 100, 200. They are eating every day prasadam. Or not morning, evening, at lunch, every time is all previous sukriti, all circumstances become favorable. Gas is available, every grain is available, organizer is available, cook is available, every circum serving 
devotees are ready, all become loving, movement is going. This is the previous Srivas was doing so nicely service, but he he as a construction building, he has to go for that. Then he everything after that going smooth. It is automatic. Who is doing this? I have no idea. It's This all favorable circumstances. Doctor become favorable. All become favorable. Everything is going on and benefit. Radha more is helping to be there. You who can help? To stop it, Maharani is. Organizing Kirtan 12 hours, now 14 hours. <coughs> 15 hours. 16 hours. You can imagine. So important is to increase superficial health. Huh? To increase for the we have to become his. <coughs> then we have to be see the mercy and inspiration, and we follow that is instruction. We know decide it. Mm. Then we are not a student. Yeah, yeah. We do not by our own. Listen, we are careful. And Ragmas, they will also talk with you. They will not talk sitting and talking. They will instruct you do this way. Mm -hmm. And you have to be open here yeah, to listen. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That is a lot. Get wise, like it's true. Uh, children education. Yeah. You see? It's happened. Nobody does anything. One idea comes to me. Can you take care of the bookstore up here? And you have many books to study of. It's a lab, like a library and this. Of course. Yeah, thank you. We have to call my call. You raise the prices. <laughs> we can adjust that it should rotate on and on and grow. Yes. Fund has to come and it goes in. Service. And if you save, then more buy the books and use it in that. So this I might want. Hmm. It should go for the service in book sale. Anything you like printing, print out. Ah. What you like, what you do in the book sale, mm. that it should be beneficial for classic deals. Mm. Like I said to make one Jananda book. What a beautiful Jananda Maharaj write a book in Prem Bhakti Chandrika. 
very easy to understand. So you have to translate the whole thing. These are all, they make the book today. But to English, though. So. Yeah. No, but one thing, then you go through the big subject, Prem Bhakti Chandrika. Prem Bhakti Chandrika, you understand, Raj Bhakti is clear. Is a foundation of the project. Yeah. Well. Say that. Yeah. Mm. The Leela Kata cannot be done with others no. than with Rasika devotees. Wow. Yeah. Even the Lord himself is very greedy to taste these topics with the Rasika devotees. With Rasika, Manjiris are also like Rasika devotees. So, when the Manjiris talk about Krishna, to make happy to Radhika, Krishna become very happy. Mm. And Radhika become very happy. From the mouth of Rasika, Katha become more sweeter because the realization they talk. The beauty of Rasika. Like Rasmai come after a long time. From your mouth, so sweet, Katha. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. yeah. You are the sweetest. Right there. Yeah. When I see you, I become a little sweet. Little. <laughs> <laughs> Rasmai, you make the devotees wait so long to hear your voice. Yes. Yeah. Shirati. Well, that is standing. Your recording has to come. <laughs> no, you know, yeah. you say. Yeah. Yeah. Mahaprabhu told to Sri Ramananda Rai, Chaitanya Charitamrita, you and I will stay together at Puri and blissfully spend the time yeah, oh. speaking, speaking about Krishna. <laughs> the Acharyas. Why Chaitanya is Radhika and Rai Ramanand is Visakha. So they say, only we will talk about Without your association, how I can be with Krishna? Because you are my Sakhi, Vishakhe. You know my heart and why, what satisfied my heart. My lover is only when I listen the words of my lover, it satisfied my heart. And you know all the circumstances. So how I can live without you? When we will go to Jagannath Puri, we both will live. And I want to become more mad to remember these circumstances. Because that is Lassika talk. When we say about this loving pastime and Radha Rani say this to
be Sasha. Rara. We both will live together. And both you will make me to cry and I will become more mad. In Gambira. Sridhar. The Acharyas are extraordinary knowers of rasa and by associating with their vani words, one associates with them directly. And Relishing their sweet words in the company of like-minded, saintly Rasika devotees yeah. is both the means and the goal. For the yogis, the Lord says this, uh -huh. A mean and goal? The way and the goal. Goal? Relish. <laughs> it's in the cream Read the mind. Relishing their sweet oh, words. Pull, pull, pull. The mind. Acharyas are extraordinary knowers of rasa. Yeah. Understand. Who is the Acharya? Who you know the philosophy, not Acharya. Who you know the rasa? Juicy side, juicy side. <laughs> not sour side. <laughs> They are They are well. The Acharyas are extraordinary knowers of Rasa. Yeah. And by associating with their Vani. Words. 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 Vani and Bapu. There are two things. Vani is the words. Bapu is a body. Body service and Vani service. There are two types of terms. Vani service, I follow the words of my channel. This is also service. And I do the massage. I take care of the clothes and washing and this and that is also Baku service. It's the body service, caring to the uh, my group. So if you complete both of service, is a both his service, but the highest service to follow the Bani of the Acharyas, words of the Acharyas. That is the highest service. That you never separate with your Acharyas, uh, your Guru, with that service. He is living inside you. And he will remind the words this time is for you. This is the words. And to do that way is your sons. Io see the other Atulano. Yeah. Mm -hmm.
perché non ti sento scusa yeah. Yeah? relishing relishing their sweet words in the company of like minded saintly ah, like minded Like my same mind, same relishing their sweet words in the company of like-minded, saintly, rasika devotees. Saintly and rasik. Three conditions. <laughs> like-minded, saintly and rasik. Is both the means and the goal. This is the meaning and goal. Meaning means that this is the way, and this is the goal of life. Pray for you. That is the practice. In your soul bounds. Meaning means the foundation. Asha and Visha is that. Then he, this Asha will make you the real goal. Same for you. Gaura Chandra. Yeah, listen, yeah. You are you will keep it up. Recording is recording. Yeah. Recording is on Yeah. Yeah. Shirade. For the yogis. The Lord said this in Bhagavad Gita. Yeah. The yogi always remains within himself in a lonely place, controlling his senses and his mind, free from desires and not taking anything for himself. Wow. So good. In the Shankya Darshan, there is a verse saying, When you live with many people together, anger and conflicts will arise, yeah. and the resultant quarrel will ruin your yoga practice. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> just just as the maiden's bangles always jingle as long as she moves her hands and as long as she wears even more than one bangle on each wrist but when the Lord discusses the devotional practice of the devotees, then he says, My devotees have given their minds and their hearts to me. Prabhupada uh, Sisi <laughs> now, Yogi, Jnani, Karmi, and Bhakta. 
Nobody understands this. They think this is the group, one of that we have to practice. Yogi, Jnani, Karmi, Bhakta. But read again this. But when the Lord discusses the devotional practice of the devotees, He says, My devotees have given their minds and their hearts to Me. They converse about Me with each other and always enlighten each other. This keeps them very happy and satisfied. Because Bhagavad Gita 10.9 Tulasi is the embodiment of deep love and affection and she is immersed in the flavors of the devotional service of Mahabhava Mai Radhika. Yeah. Suddenly, the vision vanishes and Sri Raghunathan anxiously prays, O oh Goddess, your teeth defeat even the big Gaja Mukta pearls in beauty. When will I ornament them with red colored lines that make them look like pearls surrounded by strings of rupee? This is the end of verse 40. That's the devotion. So Prabhupada, you understand, he studies all, then he writes the Bhagavad Gita. And he gave every everything in small meaning. And he write this is mallow is a very adequate subject. Elaborate. I love it, but my English is not very good. I love Britain. Huh? Elaborate. You have to sit near to me. Yes. Hmm? Yeah. Good. Yeah. समझे भाई अरे सुबह जी हाँ कल
some time for questions to the Kurunga Sundar. So we have some time for questions, maybe someone would they like will to answer. ask to say or share something. Sharing, sharing. In Croatia. And I want to say, Wednesday, there is a international sharing. I explained before that. So, um, this uh, Wednesday on the on the occasion of Radash to me, uh, as I think most of you were also there, we, we did a Zoom uh, where all the Radha Dasis came together and shared and about their feelings towards Radharani, Guru Manjari, and our path. So that was so inspiring. And Guru Dev wishes that we continue that every Wednesday, same time, like 4.30 Indian time means uh, one o'clock uh, European time. And we will share the link of that the meeting also in the Radha Dasyam group. And uh, it was actually initiated and inspired by Suniti Didi. And uh, uh, the, the, the uh, sharing is called International Radha Dasyam Sharing Day. So we thought the week weekend is always so far away. So we Ali. need in the middle of the week also, uh, you know, some uh, food for our soul. So every Wednesday now, we will also have the sharing. If somebody is busy working, yeah. they can send the recording on. Yes, sharing after sharing. By recording. Mm -hmm. And they have to write the name who wants to share. So this has to be in list. Okay. And in maybe advance, like on Tuesday. Yeah. They have to send in some place you have to make. They can write you, they will share. And then you make the list, this one by one they will come. So and then all has to share. That day I will listen on this. Yes, we want to. Listen. How much homework and realization goes inside? I will take it. In all languages they can talk, no problem. So you can send your whoever wants to say something on on Wednesday in the sharing. Can send a, a message to Suniti Didi either on Viber or WhatsApp, and she will make the list and, and coordinate. Yeah, Suniti, you can ask Didi, you can also put your WhatsApp in the Radha Dasan group, no? so everybody has. A... I give one name, that's my mother will she is making painting. And she will explain the painting feelings, <laughs> the bhava there. Jai. No. I, I nominate this her name that she has to explain. Lava. I get. Jai Ho. Others, they have to give them first. I love her very much. She makes so nice things. Yeah. Come soon. <laughs> Thank you, Gurudev. Stop shooting. Stop shooting. Stop shooting. Yeah. Radhe, Radhe, Guru Dev, thank you. Radhe. What it means? Today also, conclusion is this. If the center is with the Rasika, Sadhu, or one like-minded people, this is the foundation, ashram. This self makes me plain prayer. This plain prayer means Manjari Sarup fiction.